Hello everybody, welcome to Woodfired Weekly at Manor from Devon Cooking School. This week we're going to be roasting pineapple, making a mojita salsa and putting that all together with some vanilla ice cream to make an absolutely delicious dessert. We're going to start by preparing the pineapple, but I'm already getting the oven ready by burning down some sticks. And once those are burnt down to embers, I'm going to sit a Tuscan grill over the top to get nice and hot to roast our pineapple. But I want to see those burnt down to nice embers before I do that. So we're going to take our pineapple apart, chop the top off, chop the bottom off, get rid of those, sit it on the side and just take the outside peel off, not too deep, just the green stuff. What I want to do now is take these eyes out because they're all a bit woody and, and gritty and I'm going to do that uh, with a sharp knife so I swap from my heavy knife to a, a little sharp knife and I just kind of cut a groove just underneath those eyes following down the sort of diagonal ring of that spin it over come back the other way pop that out and that's that little ring of eyes gone The next one, and so I'm really trying not to waste any more pineapple than I have to. Free of eyes, mostly free of green stuff, but I've left all of these ridges of flesh, so not so wasteful. My fire is almost down to embers, so at this point I'll pop in the, the grill, let it warm up a little bit with the fire. I'm going to chop the pineapple into eight pieces. Take out a little bit of the centre, not all of it, because that kind of holds it together, but I'm getting rid of a little bit of that woody centre. It also gives me a nice flat surface to do the final cut into eight. A little bit of olive oil on those. Absolutely packed full of sugar, of course, so we don't need any sugar. I'm going to bring the Tuscan grill out and give that a little brushing with olive oil. In this case, with a little bit of mint. And then on with the pineapple. Slide that back in directly over the embers. Whilst that's cooking, we're going to make the mojito salsa. Into there with some caster sugar and mint. And then, of course, we want the sugar to act as an abrasive. So there we go, once it's broken down, just kind of pulverizes. We want to get rid of most of the graininess so we get a nice smooth paste. There we are, it smells fantastic. We'll have a quick look at the pineapple. Getting some nice color on there. So I was careful not to get this too hot to start with, too hot to start with, and I just burn the pineapple too quickly. We've got these lovely char marks, nice coloration, nice sweetness. That'll be fantastic, but too much, and it would be a little bit bitter. We'll have a little bit of lime zest in here. And the juice of a lime. So that's smelling super zingy. And then into that, some white rum. And a little more sugar. Although it's mojito, we're not going to drink it. We're going to drizzle it over top of our ice cream and pineapple. So I want that to be a nice thick sort of drizzling consistency. It smells amazing. Time for another look at the pineapple. It 
So nice colour on both sides is what we're looking for. And if I poke it, it's gone soft, but it's not kind of falling apart. So that's perfect. Ice cream, whilst the pineapple's still warm. And our mojito salsa over the top of everything. So there we've got roast pineapple, mojito salsa, vanilla ice cream, all cooked on the grill in the Morso Forno. Thanks for watching. If you've enjoyed this video, please give us a thumbs up. We'll put notes on a recipe on our blog. Put a link to that below. See you next time.